In the Mill Bay docks at Plymouth, a two-ton, 12-foot cylinder is prepared for a spell on the seabed. It's named Glaucus, and it's to be two men's home for a week. The first experiment of the kind in Britain. A tug tows Glaucus into position by the breakwater. 19-year-old Colin Irwin designed the cylinder, and he's one of the aquanauts taking part in the seven-day dive. When the cylinder's in place, a marker boy is moored above it. Irwin's fellow diver is John Heath, 22. Both are members of Bournemouth Sub-Aqua Club. The idea was born six months ago, and since then, club members have raised a thousand pounds to finance it. A fraction of what the much-publicized transatlantic efforts have cost. That's the last the world will see of them for a while. These special pictures taken inside Glaucus give some idea of the smallness of their living quarters. As soon as the two men are inside, they take off their gear and report to the surface team that all's well. They won't stay inside all the time. They plan to make underwater trips by day and night. But that phone will remain their only link with the upper world. Meanwhile, a full program of work and experiment in a very praiseworthy amateur project.